Hi, my name is Heather Chestnut, and I am the author of Counsel Please Rise. Being the mother, the single mother of three sons, I realized very early on that adventures needed to be a big part of this, and I started camping with them. I'd camped growing up because I'm from a rural area, but I had never gone camping being the only adult before. And we went off on a few camping trips and it was pretty funny. I found out some things the hard way. Um, even though I'd been camping, I had never been in charge of setting up a camp. And the first time we went out, we had an old tent and it kept falling down. It fell down on us in the middle of the night. But my sons thought it was a great adventure and they thought it was wonderful to keep trying to put that tent back up. I found out later it was a tent defect and someone gave us a new tent for Christmas so we didn't have that problem anymore. But we went on a lot of outdoor adventures, um, uh, rappelling, whitewater rafting. Um, we hiked all over the place in Utah and Idaho and we just loved our time and we, we joined a lot of groups, uh, talking about wildlife, um, talking about the way people work the land as ranchers or as farmers, and they learned about all those things. In my book, I share a number of personal experiences, and they inevitably involve my family, particularly my, my husband, my parents, my sister, who is a wonderful example of charity, and my sons. And when I think about my own spiritual growth, it is just an inevitable conclusion that my spiritual growth is connected with everyone I know, and particularly those in my family. As I've grown spiritually, um, in particular, well, in many of the areas, but brotherly kindness and patience in particular come to mind. Family relationships and any relationships really require these attributes. And as we grow in these attributes, our relationships become better. Not only does our bond with other people become better and our relationships much more fun and much more pleasant, but other people grow too. Because as, as I found that I was more patient, I found other people in my family would be more patient. As I grew in brotherly kindness, I found they did as well. Temperance, um, which can involve anger and many other um, difficult emotions that we grapple with all become better if we work on them together. Every one of us needs grace sometimes. I actually never saw anyone work in the system who didn't make some kind of a mistake at one time or another. And we need grace, and obviously in our families we do. So um, I'm hoping that part of what people learn in my book is to extend grace to each other more.